Hey guys, how's it going? Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a QR code that will grab the IP address of whoever scans it. So, let's get started. This video is made for educational purposes only. Alright, the first thing we are going to be doing is opening up our web browser and searching QR code generator. And we're going to go to qrcodegenerator.com. And this is what we're going to need for our first step. Alright, the next thing we're going to do is come over to our web browser again. And we're going to search Grabify. And this is an IP logger and URL shortener. Um, so it's going to be grabify.link. This first one right here. And then we're going to need a URL to mask. So we'll just search any old news article. This Netherlands versus Turkey URLs one is fine. We'll copy the link address. We'll paste it into here. And then we'll create a URL for it. So we'll agree with the terms and conditions. And then we'll go ahead and create us a new URL. So we'll go ahead and copy that URL. And then we can come back here. And we can come to URL. And then we can enter our website in here. And then we will have our finished QR code right here. So I'm going to take my phone out and I'm going to grab that QR code and it's going to take me to the article with the Turkey Euro game. But if we come to Grabify and we copy our tracking code and we go back to Grabify and we paste our code we can see that we have a result right here and it shows my IP address and the country and state it's from and the user agent so what kind of phone it is um, version etc so this right here is a real quick example of a bad or malicious QR code. So that's it for this video. Just wanted to make a quick video showing you guys just how scary QR codes can be. You never know what's hiding behind that URL that that QR code is attached to or what malicious information is behind that QR code. So stay, out, stay safe out there, stay vigilant, and thanks for watching.